my loves welcome back to my channel i'm actually in the middle of getting ready i've actually done my makeup already um but i actually want to add on some under eye lashes i've been used doing that a lot recently i used to do it back in the day um and i recently bought some new mascara a random nyx one in boots and i'm loving the looks also bought this palette from revolution it is so cute like has all of the colors that i like all of the like warm tones i've actually been using some bits on my eyes today as well love it so anyway let's add some mascara on the bottom lash so yeah, it's been really um, hard because a lot of the stuff I've been doing has obviously involved a lot of family and stuff like that, which I don't vlog for obvious reasons. So I end up having days of no vlogging, which he's gone, he's left me. So that's basically what happened. And today is gonna be one of those days as well because today my boyfriend and I are gonna pick up our niece, his niece, and um, head to our friend's house and let them have like a little play day kids play day so obviously i'm not gonna vlog that either we also wanted to find some time to look at some watches and hop into flannels because there are these shoes on the flannels website that my boyfriend was gonna buy for me um but my size sold out so a part of me wants to go into flannels to see if they have it in store who knows um that would be like crazy if they did and he will obviously have to buy them for me so we'll see also guys i did my hair oh which i'm gonna actually sort out now in the living room but i did my hair you guys i've done a middle part first of all i dyed the weave black which i never ever do but i love the way it looks on like my friends that dye their hair black all the time um, because my actual hair is black <laughs> so it actually blends perfectly color wise with my hair now unlike usual sorry i forgot I need this mirror um and it's super long super like thick middle part it's just literally old school jade like you guys it's literally old school jade and that's what i'm do more of what makes me feel glam what makes me feel hot what makes me feel like a barbie that is what we're doing in 2023 so i wanted to go into the year feeling like a glamorous barbie doll again so that's what they're doing honeys i think i told you guys about this lip liner and brow pencil from this brand refi that is all i use these days anyway this color i don't know the name of it oh sepia is the darkest color that is what i use can you see oh yeah i like to just put a little bit more on the bottom on the bottom side i need to buy a new one because that is all that i have left and that is not okay also guys i need to do my nails like this is just a glittery paint that i put on it myself it needs to come off i need to get my white tips honey i will probably do that tomorrow tomorrow's friday i need to make an appointment mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. sorry that's just a random h&m lipstick i actually really like their lipsticks i've been buying them for years and they're always on sale but I just get like these like pinky nudie colours that suit me. It's like an everyday colour. Oh my god, I love my makeup today. It looks so peachy, like pink, warm, <laughs> cute. And then I'm wearing this, I always forget the name, the Fenty Glow, Fenty Glow Gloss Bomb Lip Gloss, which has a hint of pink. To be honest, I think it has a little bit too much pink. Oh no, actually, today it looks nice. Sometimes it looks too peachy and too prominent, but I feel like today. So last night I was at home. I went and ordered some Wagamamas. That was okay. I had to like, <laughs> I had to like recook the noodles a little bit and add a bit more flavor because it was just, didn't have enough. But once I did that, it was nice. So yeah, and then I um, 
had a little bottle of champagne that was gifted to me in a PR hamper. So I was like, right, I wanna like sit down and start writing my goals. But I didn't do that. I actually decided to write down a list of all or as many as I can think of my achievements for 2022. And I highly, highly recommend you guys do this. I encourage you guys to do it. So I felt so good, it was like a celebration. So I popped open my um, little bottle of champagne, had a little sip of that, um, and then wasted the rest. <laughs> But yeah, I did that, that was nice. So now, like this evening when I come home and tomorrow being Friday, I can use these next two days to actually focus more on what I want for the new year. I did start writing a little bit of a list for New Year's Eve. I'm gonna be going to church and I'm so excited. All I need to do now is decide what I'm gonna wear. Something casual, like comfy trousers, maybe a vest because your girl is coming on and the, the cramps are already starting. They're already starting. Also though, my bathroom is looking messy, so we're gonna put everything away. Also changed the art up there, but I'll show you guys that properly later. Right, hair time, let's do this. I'm not even gonna talk to you guys because I genuinely wanna get ready real quick. And I do not know what I'm gonna wear, but as you can see, my hair is long again and black. I love it, I feel so young with it. I feel like 22, 23 year old Jade right now, and it is giving. So, yeah, remember this brush that I got in PR? Oh, still love it. It is from, um, does it say it on here? Yeah, Charlotte Mensa. Charlotte Mensa paddle brush. It just defines your wave. Obviously, this is not the best example because my curls are old, but I'll show you guys later after I do my hair. Isn't she cute? <laughs> guys, I have never been more excited to do a video than I am today. Just a year ago, I was you. I was clicking into all these videos about how to grow on YouTube, and it was the same every single time, and it was driving me absolutely bonkers. All right, guys, my hair is curled. Now I'm gonna use my um, Charlotte Mensa. It's a finishing oil mist. I don't do too much, and I probably won't do this for another like week. It just, it actually kind of helps finish literally and almost like define the curl pattern a bit. Let me just brush it. You see that guys? Oh, I love this brush. It just does something so good to my curls. I think it's this paired with the oil. It's amazing. Cause I just really want my hair to be like relaxed vibes today makeup is oh oh my gosh please excuse that plug it keeps falling down and i've like secured it anyway hair is done makeup is done i just need to figure out my little hair what i do is just a little spritz and then just um it helps to blend okay now i need to get dressed um i kind of have an idea of what i want to wear trainers maybe combat of some kind a vest let's keep it moving because today is auntie day and auntie can be cute but auntie also needs to be comfortable because kids are no joke and honestly my stomach i'm just like oh. and i haven't eaten guys i have not eaten sorry i'm just i'm just really feeling myself today 2023 we're going to get this face snatched that is what we're going to be doing by the way because yeah still cute but a little chubby so let me get some socks on now because I'm actually going to wear some trainers. These babies are coming out. I've actually only worn them once. You guys remember these. I included them as part of my gift guide. Um, my boyfriend bought these for me. Funny enough, he left his here and I'm gonna show you guys the size difference. <laughs> so mine are a size six and his, are they a nine? I don't know, I think they're a nine. It's rubbed off. But yeah, I think his are like a nine or a 10. We're gonna go here. I love this angle. <laughs> Sorry, but the only reason why this is new is because I moved, I had loads of books on my coffee table um, and around, and I've actually piled them all up in this corner. What I wanted to show you guys, this is my 2022 achievements list. Um, and I'll read a couple out for you. Um, but yeah, I found a wrap at a house. Um, I secured an interior project managing opportunity. 
Um, I've been going to the gym regularly. I started Pilates. I wrote for Stylist Magazine. I bought quite a few pieces of designer clothing, which is something I wanted more quality clothing and stuff. Um, I grew on TikTok and um, I have a post that's over 300K. I gained 10,000 Instagram followers in one year, which is amazing for me. Um, so yeah, there's just little things like that that are on there. Obviously, there's some other things like financial goals, income goals that I've secured and stuff like that. I highly recommend you guys do that. The other thing I did is 2023 um, and I started them all with I will. So I will... I don't want to tell you guys. I feel embarrassed. I'm not telling you guys, but you guys should do that. <laughs> um, another thing I want to show you before I have to leave, I actually have to leave this house, is I bought a planner. Um, 2023 calendar diary this one is supposed to stay at home unless I have like work days where I take my laptop out and um, because of the size it can't travel with me all the time but that's fine it's big enough to also be with my laptop and every single month has its own calendar and that is what I look for personally in a diary um, I have another planner which is really good it doesn't have dates to it so you can do it yourself but they're more like daily planner -esque, whereas this is more monthly planner so they are different this just gives me a nice high level view of my month what I'm doing etc planning is it a filming day am I going to the gym but then each month also has um its own like breakdown as well i also got a similar one but slightly smaller um like brown leather one for my mom so i need to give that to her when i see her for the new year and that is it now i need to leave but i love this i love i love the light everything is just let me show you what you're actually on before I leave. I need to take Rich out for the walk. So all of my different cool books are now over here. Oh, my mum's on the phone with her client. Okay, that's why. Because she wanted to see my hair. So I FaceTimed her and she didn't answer. Oh, does anyone else's mum do that? This is the Desenio art. How nice does it look? So I went for something really muted, you guys, that I told you about. I wanted like white, neutral, like textured vibes. And what is really cool about Desenio as well is they actually have these exact pieces in actual canvases um they are more expensive obviously because you're getting the real thing um but because i already had the black frames and i like the contrast it gives i went for the posters instead i didn't want black i want like a green or something that pops I think it's two grand. Two grand. It's not two grand, is it? Fifty. <laughs> okay, so that was a fail. There's nothing in here. Someone doesn't want to look at cars anymore. So now we're going to go and look at watches. I don't tire for play play. Take say now you go hold me down. That's so free. Get that all gold one because that's actually really nice. Hi everyone. So this is where I am, looking at cars today, with my mum and my auntie. Um, hi. Just gonna see what I find. filming, yeah? Already getting caught filming. <laughs> oh, Teslas. Is that, I thought they were more money than this, you know? I never considered a Jaguar, you guys, but, but these Jaguars are so nice. What? It's giving me a bit of Tesla vibes, but I really like them. This one's actually nice. This is actually really nice. Okay, I want to look at um, the Audis and the Mercedes, like SUV. So here's one of the options, you guys. I don't know if I'd get black though. I really like this white. I like the white one. What do you like? The black? The floors are all out. They don't even hate this room. They've gone in this room as well. Hello, 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 guys. Today I am on site. I've come to check on it and see what they have done. And so far they have taken out a lot of flooring. Great. Um, I've also had to bring some kitchen sample things today because I just met up with my kitchen supplier. I don't know who left the TV on. Who is messaging me? Okay, she's going to speak to the builders. Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to another day in my life. So it's 10 a.m. I have makeup on. 
and my hair i haven't done but it's fine for now from yesterday um so yeah i just thought i would continue this thing up of showing you guys like bits and bobs of what i get up to in my day so as you know afternoon almost you guys so i did actually try to say hello about two hours ago and my battery died so here we are again i'm currently sitting at my makeshift office which is literally the window ledge in my living room looking out onto very gray and boring and ugly views and a wet window because it's raining but i just thought i would actually sit here because this morning has been quite busy i have been on the phone to my kitchen builder for the project i'm working on the house renovation um we had to move our meeting to tomorrow because of some meeting issues and stuff so we're going to be meeting at the house tomorrow i'll take you guys along with me and we're going to be taping up the floor of the kitchen so we can see where the island goes where the bar area goes where all the things are going um and then the client can confirm they're happy with that layout so i've also been speaking with the client just looking at tile options for the bathroom so i posted a house tour three bed house that is 480k in um surrey and most people are like this is great whatever and i noticed that a lot of londoners are saying this is great great but there are some comments of people saying like how can first-time buyers or people buying their first house afford this oh i got an invitation to an event oh thank you so anyway Happy oh i have something else to tell you guys as well i'll tell you guys later because i actually have to go so i basically asked people um on my stories like what would they expect to um first of all how much would they expect to spend on their first family home down south um i said would it be under 300 under 400 under 500 because realistically it would be about 500k or under obviously between 400 and 500 i think is realistic obviously depending on where i know this person as well she said she wants five bedrooms a walk-in wardrobe a lounge laundry room a large kitchen and a garage <laughs> i think that's a lot for that price but listen it's not impossible it's 10 to 12 and this little doggy over here is scheduled for a groom finally what i love about these grooming days not that he bothers me anyway but it's kind of like a doggy daycare because he goes for the whole day there he is you can see what he looks like now he is full of hair guys full of hair oh i'm back from dropping rich to the groomer and i also did my hair because my hair was a hot mess earlier one two three four five six i've done six plans so i'm going to try and film as many of those as i physically can because i'm getting a headache because i'm actually fasting right now i don't know if i mentioned and my fast ends in 10 minutes but i haven't even prepared a meal so that's going to be really interesting guys so i'm just going to try and film as much as i can before i crash and need to have a break and then we go again first one i'm actually going to do is the london hotspots of 2023 so yeah i'm going to do that now and um yeah that's it <laughs> bye and stamp duty which is zero for first time buyers up to the property price of 425,000 so follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube if you want more property information, tours, and if you need a property finder, I'm your girl. girl. If you're planning to become a first-time buyer in 2023, mm. this is what you'll be paying for. Oh my gosh. You guys, you guys, you... Ooh, honey, focus, focus. So I have just filmed reel number two, and I look like a chocolate Barbie doll right here but the melanin is popping even more on my instagram page but yeah i'm gonna actually post this reel today because it's just looking too good and it's too good i feel like i want to start the year with this one even though i posted a reel last week but that was a tour because it's just honing in on the first time buyers and hopefully it can capture new followers at the beginning of the year who need help when it comes to finding a home this year so that's that's my marketing genius thinking i think i might have to just order like a salad or something from nando's because i haven't had time to do a food shop t today i will probably do that this evening after the gym actually but yeah i'm gonna order something now to eat um and up until that time i'm gonna film one or two more reels yeah 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 i need more orange clothes as well this looks so washed out in comparison to the reel i'm putting on the screen right now so you can see the difference and i am done filming for the day 
Also, the groomer just called me and said, Rich is ready, which I'm in shock. It's only four o'clock. And I was like, that's quick. She was like, I know, we did it really quick today. Why? Why? I was enjoying like single lone mother time. Anyway, and my Nando salad delivery just came and guys, I'm not dropping food again in this year, okay? Um, so I can't eat that. So I'll have to eat that when I get back and warm the chicken up because I don't know about you guys, but when I order Nando's, the chicken always goes back in the grill because it's not cooked enough. Maybe it's just an Essex thing. He looks cute and he knows. He knows he does. Guys, I am so hungry that I'm eating the salad without the chicken. It's in the oven grilling right now. But whoever made my salad, thank you, because they made it so tidy, so presentable, and so yummy. And I'm trying to eat now because I've got a gym class in an hour, so I want to make sure my food digests before that. That's why I should have eaten earlier, guys. But, mmm, mmm, it's so good. It's really nice. Um... So this is week two of my fitness shift. Uh, no, no, not for you. Go away, go away, go, thank you. I'm doing five uh, workouts a week. So gym five times a week. So today will be day two. Last week I did five out of five. This week I'm doing five out of five again. Hi loves, it's a new day, it is a Wednesday. I am in my gym kit, but I'm not actually going to the gym yet. I'm actually going to head off to my client's house, the project that I've been working on. I'm gonna be meeting the kitchen supplier, builder, etc. there. We are gonna do a markup and it's exciting because it's actually gonna to come to life a little bit today, kind of. Anyway, and straight from there, I'm gonna head straight back down and go to the gym so no excuses we've got the gym kit on this is one from primark that i just turned around because it's double-sided but it's like really light and floral and i just i want to be plain but these marks are really annoying i feel like there's some on my bum too i feel like it's um deodorant or something it's very annoying but <sighs> i don't have time right now to change and do all of that i just made my lunch and so i'm gonna eat that now break my fast so that there's a couple hours before the gym and guess who's just walked in richie has hi hi gorgeous doggy mummy voice is probably really annoying these leggings are very big i'm not even gonna lie to you i'm gonna have to sew them and take them in oh reminds me i need to go and collect my um all of my trousers at the dry cleaners they told me to collect it today I might have to just collect it this evening or just tomorrow morning. Do I have time tomorrow? I'm filming tomorrow. And there is my lunch. So on the sea bus, I, it looks really seasoned. It's not, it's actually paprika um, and lots of chili. <laughs> so chili flakes in there, paprika and stuff like that. And then underneath I have the baby corns, asparagus and pak choy that I just sort of sauteed. Yummy, 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 yummy. Three is good. Okay, perfect. Yeah, perfect. See you then. Okay, bye. Why did I not pick up a knife? I don't even have time. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. I need to get a knife. I posted another reel today, you guys. And I think it's doing well. But at the moment, Instagram is definitely outperforming. But... With TikTok, there's potential for me to forget about it, uh, open the app tomorrow, and it's jumped to 20k. <laughs> That's what happens sometimes. I don't know if it will happen with this one, but it's not about the views, it's about the enrichment of content. So far, for week one, I lost, I think, about three pounds, which is great. 
I'm hoping to lose about the same this week, fingers and toes crossed. But yeah, this is me at the moment. These are really, really getting on my nerves. Like I need to sew these ASAP because like it's got all this extra, it's very, very annoying. Like, I'm gonna have to be one of those girls that just does this. Hey guys, so as I said, I will meet you at the house. I'm now at the house. Uh, the builder is here. It is so cold. Um, don't ask me why I took my coat off. I just felt, you know, when you feel suffocated, like I just need to be free. Um, so now we're just drawing up the measurements on the floor of the kitchen. Um, and forgot that obviously it's sandy. So the tape is not going to stick <laughs> properly. So we're trying to like draw it with like a builder pencil or whatever. Started drawing. This is where the fridge is going to go. <laughs> Um, but the pen isn't sharp, so we're just going to go and sharpen that now. This is going to be a bar area, kind of how it is now. <laughs> um, there's going to be an island in the middle here. And then the back wall is going to be like, you know, more kitchen, sink, cabinets, blah, blah, blah. Are these measurements, in well, obviously, probably including the carcass as well? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Okay, cool. yeah, yeah. Good morning, you guys. Well, it's about 10.30 and I'm heading all the way to the other side of London. I am going to Battersea today. Woo! I'm filming a really cool apartments, actually. This is probably the closest. No, actually, we did one kind of close by uh, two years ago, but this is definitely one of the closest ones to him. So he's happy. <laughs> um, so yeah, I've got an hour and 25 minute drive. I've got my headscarf on because my hair has to stay late and it's drizzling. Hey vlog, so I'm now in Battersea at the development I'm filming. There's Marvin setting up, professional Marv. I need to put lipstick on, but this, these apartments are so nice. You guys are going to see this in a separate video and I'm, we've got three to see and I'm going to put them all together in one video. But on Instagram, they will be individual. In Essex, whereabouts? Oh, I forgot you know. But I remember, I remember seeing it though. I don't know that one. But I've only seen it once. I don't really, you don't really see this around. These no, these guys have, 2023 is the year. year. It's the year, Marvin. No, guys, remember we said this. We're coming for your necks. Oh, I look cute today. The gym is paying off, guys. My face is getting smaller. Thank God. I was gonna say that, you look smaller. Do I look smaller? Yeah, I was gonna say it to you. Do you know what I mean? I don't know. Should I bring this in more? You see? You can go like this. That's actually cute. It's actually quite cute, actually. More in? Um, or just more in? Yeah. Wow. So we have filmed the YouTube video for you guys. Now we're gonna quickly go through the reels. After this reel, we're gonna change. I'm gonna change, and then do another reel and another outfit, and then another reel and another outfit. So you guys ain't gonna see that, but I'll see you at the end. Bye. You know. Of course, like you see on their profile, like who else they're connected with. Mm -hmm. And I saw, Whoa. really? Yeah, okay. Hey guys, so I just got home. I'm so tired, look at me. My makeup did really well, but it's giving oily and my eyes feel so heavy with these lashes, so I need to take them off. Whoops, I've only got them on for you guys, but I just got in, so I thought I'd open this quickly. I think I know what it is actually. Yeah, it is. It is um, some sea moss. So sea moss has become a really popular thing the past couple of years but it's actually like a staple in i don't know about other islands but in jamaica like we have irish moss we have sea moss and things like that it's like a healthy thing for us that's very common um but i just bought some of this brand because i've been seeing it a lot and apparently it doesn't taste too bad should we try it together and also guys i have not eaten and it is like 6 30 i haven't had one meal today because I was filming, there was no time to um, like stop and have a meal. Plus I'm really not trying to like buy food out. So because of that, um, I'm gonna actually cook like a filling meal today. So obviously I've not been really having carbs, but because I've got the whole day, I need like, I need nutrition. So 
I'm not gonna have bad carbs. I'm gonna make a vegetarian meal with maybe couscous or quinoa, which is still so healthy anyway. I'm gonna have it straight. I hope it doesn't taste horrible. Oh, it stinks. It stinks. It, it actually smells like the sea. Okay, I have to stop smelling it. I'm just gonna taste a little bit now. Okay, it's gone. So CMOS has a lot of nutrients. It's like, I think it has like all of the nutrients that we have in our body or something like that from what I remember my uncles telling me when I was growing up and stuff. But it, um, it's just, I'll tell you the benefits of it. Just CMOS in general. So get it from anywhere. Um, this was actually quite expensive to be honest, but you know, sometimes when you're in a spending mood, you just order things. So CMOS increases energy, digestion, gut health, immune system, immune support skin health um dissolves excess seam um mucus and thyroid health i can't talk guys i can't talk anyway it doesn't taste that bad it's just more the consistency and the smell yuck okay i'm so hungry coconut meal okay so it's gonna be a butter bean curry today i would have done a chili but i don't have any black beans so this is what's gonna have to suffice, which always puts me in a good mood anyway, to be fair. Hi, Dad. Oh, that's nice. It's, it's cute, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, so we went to... Hey, you guys, it is Friday. And I am happy that it is Friday because today I am tired, like, so tired you guys know i'm fasting but i actually had to make myself a coffee i had to because and this is huge for me if you don't know i don't really drink coffee like <laughs> i have a couple of sachets of like the ready-made coffee stuff and when i need it i need it and today i'm actually tired so i'm literally working on the sofa today i've got two laptops two phones notebooks doing work admin stuff emails um yesterday as you saw was a long day of filming end up spending got there 12 finished at like four we did a lot of stuff a lot of work a lot of content yesterday so hopefully that all looks good my videographer is literally messaging me now sending everything over i like to edit my reels myself that's one thing that i like to do myself to be honest i actually edit all my videos the move of jade youtube videos he will do like a soft edit not really an edit he'll just like chop out all the unnecessary parts and put it all together and then i will go through and actually edit so yeah i do all my editing myself pretty much like um but the reels he's she's absolutely can't wait for a good mood oh. but yeah my reels yeah no i literally edit them myself because the thing is it's usually done on my phone but because my phone was so low yesterday on battery we used his camera so i'm a little bit nervous because i'm like so used to iphone footage on my instagram that i'm a bit scared not gonna lie but we'll see anyway coffee hey rich you all right he just had his um his favorite snack which was a p p l e s cannot say the word because he knows it um he had quite a bit and he's looking at me like he wants more but he's not getting you're not getting any more buffs oh you can see his face there um anyway just opened this pr from ren i'm so grateful they've got me on their pr list and they make amazing products so in today's pr is the boost and protect oh this is heavy um smooth prep and plump essence go i need this it goes through it's got like a diagram here of like how it goes through the layers of your skin i don't know if you guys can see that but proven to optimize skincare absorption which i need so that it actually gets in oh so this is the bottle i went to the gym this morning i haven't been showing you guys gym sessions because honestly when i go to the gym i'm just want to i'm just in the zone and i get out most of the time and sometimes i do classes which i'm not going to film because other people are there but maybe eventually i will actually ask my friend to film a session for me sometimes we don't go to the gym every day together maybe like once a week i see her or twice so maybe next week that is what i will try in the next vlog we'll see but i'm also figuring it out i'm not a professional gymmer i just do what i think is working for me and actually this is week two I don't really do a weigh-in until Sunday, but so far this week, 
it looks like I have lost another pound, pound and a half. So that's good. I'm on track for the plan that I have set myself for the month of Jan. Feet are straight out. <laughs> it feels like moving out, but it's really, really not. It's really time to go. Yeah, we're gonna yeah. sit. We don't know, so I'll be right back and let you guys know what happens from here. Oh, gorgeous! Oh my god, this is this is HD HD. Is it? Wow. All the, all the issues. No issue. What issue? Look at some people's issues, guys. Your leader Jade is mad. So cute. I like this hair colour on you, it's really uh, some of you might be thinking that I stood up here last year and said this was a one-off, didn't I? <laughs> but we're actually going to take more <laughs> content because I've actually got some other outfits because you know I don't come to London often so when I do I want to make the most of it what so do you rate my photo taking skills to be honest no Vic you I do I'm a solid 7 ah! <laughs> the girl is been telling me that I'm a 10 and you said you're 10 oh <laughs> just, I think it's not you I think it's me I've been saying I'm that done, today done, done, done. I think because I'm not used to taking pictures anymore and I'm adjusting to this size of my face Guys, look at Which the person is. Vic, please. I'm gonna put Vic's picture on the screen and look how cute she is and look how many takes. We only did like what 20? How many picks did we do for me? Like a hundred? And I don't do I even like them? Do you know, know what it is? It's when you take photos here, you need to look back with fresh eyes. I just saw a TikTok about Yeah, no, it's true. I'm gonna yeah. look at it when I get home or on the train. Honestly, you look at it in like a week's time and you'll be like, shit, no, these this bang. Because nice. the pictures I took of you banged. If you don't post, I'm gonna post it on my account and say it's me. I'm just too so yeah. Thank you. Thank you. We just stumbled across this cute gallery. I want to say pictures. I've changed as well. <laughs> We're just being weird. We're gonna find a nice spot. Hey loves, it's Sunday. I am very, very tired. Yesterday was a very long day for me. I'm just helping set up the party. Being at the party, got home super late and then conked out. Have to basically like reshoot a piece of work that I'm doing for a brand. This has been going on for over a month, <laughs> but today I'm gonna just like reshoot it send it over tomorrow and hopefully we can like move on um but yeah i'm really really tired you guys so i'm gonna be joining church on my hour journey to my mum's because if i went after church there'd be it would just be long and yeah there's some other things i have to do today so anyway let me not be too much of a damp mood <laughs> um i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog it was you know a combination of all the things i have been doing uh this january to do with work to do with life um and it just gives you a bit more insight into what i get up to and what i do day to day so i will probably do the same thing again this week so stay tuned for the next vlog the next property tours i filmed tours this week which you saw um and yeah we're just gonna keep this youtube thing going I love you guys. I'm tired. <sighs> but I'll see you all in the next video. And comment down below. Make sure you're subscribed as well. Let me know what you found most interesting. What you want to see more of. All of that good stuff. Bye.